Celebrating Babalik Salop ng Pilo and Flying V Center in San Juan City on this beautiful Friday. Ikalabing walo ng Agosto taong 2017. Lang araw na lang, no? How many weeks ago? Bare months na? Okay, September. Bare months na ulit? Bilis na. Kapit na, December. Ang dama na regalo sa akin, ha? Kaso ah, sulit yun, ha? <laughs> Fourth quarter on the way. Thank you for joining us, Andre Felix. With the writer Henry Tuano, and we also have Princess Legaspi at court side. Our director, Al Neri, our great producer. Our third game is Mark Morados, a.k.a. Mano. And our Sultan of Stats, Wong Lujanes, right beside us. Happy birthday to Marilyn Kiliofas from Joseph Kiliofas. And uh, that many bad decided, Mamiya, we will greet them for the next dead ball situation. Grospe gets the ball back for Jair Q. Mendoza. Trapped there by two defenders. Abdul Wahab, get the extra pass. Oh, but nice block by Dixon. How about Dixon? Oh, ganda ng ginagawa ni Dixon. Aggressive on both ends. Yes. Siguro isa sa mga instructions si Coach T.Y. na don't look at that score na. Just keep on playing hard. Ito yun ang ginagawa ni Dixon. Four minutes seconds to shoot. Bordon. Crossbe. The jumper by John. Wala. Luchu gets the board. Lasketi ahead to Grossbe. John Irvin Grossbe scores. Nobody. Nobody stopped Grossbe in that layup. Grossbe, 10 points in the first half. Uh -huh. Four points only here in the second half. That was his second basket made here in the second half. John Grossbe with 14. Chodoro with 13. Mendoza gets the ball back to Jer Yu. Mendoza slows down, misses, and then Abdul Wahab loses a handle on the ball. Yeah, he didn't have anything else. Oh, yeah, that's it. That turnover and your ball. Let's go back to Milo Nutria. Galic move up the corner. Crosby. Well, I'm so maybe, you know? Actually, I'm going to see Crosby in the side. 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 Luigi Velasco, son of former head coach of CSB, Gabby Velasco, is there on the floor. Mendoza attacking Velasco. Good, good defensive stop by Velasco, but he will be called for a personal foul. There's Chodoro, 3 of 5 from 3-point oh, country. 13 six. points Velasco. after scoring just two way back in the first foul. quarter. Pumutok siya sa second half, specifically in that third period. Here's Mendoza at the line, second leading scorer of JRU. In six games played in 28 minutes per game, averaging 12.5 points, four rebounds, four assists, and a steal. All right, Jed Mendoza. And now for her fourth quarter report, let's go back to Princess. Thank you so much, Dre and Ren Ren. So, still on the aggressive approach, um, CSP and Coach T.Y. is still looking at a good end game for his team. With Day Day scoring so much during the second half, uh, Young and Castor are forced to work for CSP a lot harder this time. And Coach Charles is pushing pressure and foul advantage during the fourth, fourth, and fourth quarter. Will this save CSP for this game? That we have to see. Back to you, Ren Ren and Dre. Marami salamat sa'yo, Cesc. They're down by 30, 74-44, although it's still mathematically possible. Six uh, seconds to shoot. Maybe highly improbable, but you know, um, you've seen crazier things in Renderen yes. in your basketball career. Of course. Amateur man, collegiate, or pros. Bilugong bola. Ika nga. As cliche as it sounds, Velasco. Young will bring it back out to Castor. You did mention Castor during a halftime analysis that he has to step up. He misses from the outside. Luchu. Foul down low and will be charged on Abdul Wahab. That's his fourth. Bang apat na ngayon ng Ghana native. Medyo talagang foul trouble. Pronto itong si Luchu. 
kailangan na kailangan pa naman siya dito sa loob. If he's sitting down on that bench, wala siyang magagawa. Pammy tweets, wanna travel, take pics, and food hunting with Patucci. <laughs> Hindi yun yung spelling, pero we know it's Patucci. Sabi naman ni Ina Marie, gusto ko makasama sa travel as si Philip Ponteos, the younger brother of Paolo. Go, go, go. Hashtag, haters gonna hate. Philip is mine. <laughs> Pinangkin na. <laughs> Mga girlfriend naman. Ah, uh, baka. Possible. Yari siya pag hindi yun. <laughs> Ikaw, kanino ka ba? Or go. Ah, kala ko akin din. <laughs> Marami may ari ata sa'yo, Brad, eh. Wala. <laughs> Atiin na yung katawan mo. Pero hindi nila mahati puso. Ayun lang. <laughs> Solid pa rin ba yan? <laughs> Mabiyak na. <laughs> Ika minsan tataka ako bakit tayo pinagsasama sa EF. <laughs> Carlo Young at the line. It was a flagrant foul called on Abdul Wahab Abdul Razak. Kaya nga pinigyan ng two free throws plus possession at the College of St. Benil. Oh, I mean, this nga lang yung unang uh, free throw. On the young. Anthony Carlo Young. That's right. So, may contact breaks dito sa para sa CSB. Let's see if they can capitalize. Oh, oh and Young oh, gets it from three. the outside. Carlo Young today already has 13 points also as well. Ikaw mo naman, itong Jolly Team Saint Video, hindi pa rin tumitigil sa kaka-pressure. Itong ating Vivo perfect shot, perfect selfie. Castor, then Young steps back. Knocks down. Shot from downtown. Rospin, down low. Laschetti. The kick out to Mendoza. Mendoza inside, Abdul Wahab. Oh, goes out, rolls out. Maka kay Abdul Wahab. Pero... Heavy bombers were so patient in that uh, play. The execution nila talaga, precise talaga. Velasco finds season opening. Just cannot convert the layup. That was a good move by Velasco. So he's been uh, given playing time here. Coach D. Waitang, Coach Charles Dew just shaking their heads. The sidelines. Laschetti scores inside. Nobody rotated. Castor gambled. Yung manya si Laschetti was wide open. He moved back toward in that play. Dun mo kikita yung court vision ni Grospe. Yung sinasabi natin uh, yung uh, passing skills niya talaga for a big man is above average. Oh yeah. Grospe. Stepping on the line just inside the three point line. Wala. Delavirian says. Wait a minute. 76-48 is our tally. Grosbe, contra kay Dixon. Grosbe, the fall away, difficult shot. And Luchu secures the ball for CSB. Castor, ahead to Dixon, too strong. Ang lakas nung pasa ni Castor. Hindi, alam niyang mabilis na si Dixon, pero for sure, hindi naman ganun mabilis. Ito si Dixon to get that pass. It was so advanced. Magpapahingay na Coach Verhel, si Grospe. Bumasak naman si Sawat. I think uh, Coach D. Waitang has also you know, given up the white flag. Nilabas niya na ang kanyang mga main guys. Lu Chu is already on the bench. Dixon on the bench. Matt Johnson on the bench. Eric Feely on the bench. Carlo Young on the bench already. Carlos Suarez. Yes. Mga second and third stringers na. Si Delavir in! Di pa tapos. Passenger Root knocks down that three. Now, ito yung uh, mga pinapasok ni Coach D. White ang they should take advantage of this. Of course, dito makikita ni Coach D. White kung sino yung pwede niyang gamitin in the next few games nila. Itong pinakamalaking kalamangan ng Jerry, 31. They can even extend this lead. Delaver head. Delaverhead 
now to Lasketi. Under four minutes, ang nalalabi sa ating game clock on our third game this afternoon against San Sebastian. Victorious in our first game, kanina ng alas 12, winning over TAC 75-73. And then uh, LPU, after being down for most of the game against yeah. Letran, they were even down at the half by nine. Pero nakabawi ang LPU, getting their eighth win in season 93. Our Vivo player profile is that man from Giginto, Bulacan, the 6-4 forward of JRU, playing his final year team captain, John Irvin Grosby, with 14 points, five assists today. He's very consistent and very efficient. I don't see si Grosby. Talaga nang, uh, you know, it's his final year. Yes. He's also trying to build his stocks up. Tinataas niya yung kanyang marketability. If he wants to go to the pros after oh. the NCAA. Now called on Luigi Velasco. You face. Para kay Coach Verhel Menezes. It's uh, Sibangan who's coming in for the first time in this game. JRU has eight players with at least six points. CSB only has three. Here up again CSB, may tawi the bola. They're two and 37 remaining in this game. Hindi pa rin tumitigil. Ang heavy bombers, nakaka pressure from the, from the back court. Oh, and they force an eight second violation. Eight seven, Dela and and Sibangan was able to force that turnover. And the two veterans, Gio Lasqueri, the playing assistant coach, along with Tete Teodoro, all smiles for JRU. Sakabilang bahagi naman is the complete opposite. Coach D. Waita and CSB Blazers will obviously drop here to two and six in season 93. Paranamas at JRU, they will go up four wins and three losses in season 93. Just will be a, one, a game behind the Letra Knights. Nanatalo kanina oh. sa Lyceum. Every game counts na, especially patapos na tayo sa first round. Pagdating ng second round yan, mas ah, magiging high intensity, more exciting ang games natin. Everybody's gonna fight for that final four spot. That's its story. Para sa JRU, two guys. Let's get a seven assist. Grosby has five. And yung buong uh, CSB team has only six assists. JRU still has uh, two more games after this one. TSB mm. only has a game left after this. Before heading into the All Star break. Naboa. Inside Three Santa Maria. Santa Maria. Seven assists for CSB as a team, equaling Gio Lasquetti's assist total. Castor is also now in the game for JRU. That's Lloyd Castor. Mahirap talaga mga ako ng assist if you're struggling from the field. <laughs> Juarez missing from the outside. De La Virgen. Salud pa rin si MJ De La Virgen para kay Coach Virgen. Castor. Bordon back out to Sibangan. Here's Sibangan. Nine to shoot. Bordon. Bordon gets fouled. At uh, yun ang itatawag kay Buni, will be on Bernard Buni. That's his first personal foul. Four on the Blazers. Fourteen to shoot. Nahan inside, nice pass. Gagal pa ng pass ni hey, Sibangan kay Abdul Sawad. Twenty-one assists. Para, or may that, twenty-two. Para sa JRU, yun kanina pa natin napansin talaga eh. Yung uh, passing na itong JRU Heavy Bomber sa start pa lang ng ball game. They were sharing that basketball. Nabo the three. You know what, Pinang, pinanggit na at pinag-usapan natin rin-rin 
obviously naman CSB is in that rebuilding mode, yes. rebuilding process, you know, um, adjusting live after coach Gabby Velasco, yeah. now with the new coaching staff at the helm, led by coach T. Y. Tang. Uh, had a great career in the UAAP, great uh -huh. career also in the pros. Assistant coaches Ali Pig, Shot Tankinsen, uh, Charles Tew. Uh, he has materials, young players, but at this point, yung growing pains. Oh, oh. Diba, ikaw ba pinagdanan mo yan as a player before? Ha? Huh? Magaya bang ka? Hindi. <laughs> Hindi mo pinagdaanan yan. Pinagdaanan din siya. Dominante, dominante. Hindi naman, pinagdaanan din. Siyempre, pag... Kasi high school mo, dominante yung San Beda. Oh, pero... Pag-ibig mo ng college, dominante yung Lasal. Yan yun yung napapansin ng mga tao. Of course, yung nagtiyo champion. Hindi nila napansin yung how I grew as a person and as a player. Siyempre, I struggled also in my younger years. Buti naman pala humble ka, inamit ka din. Na nag-struggle ka din pala sa karir mo. Just right. Well, handshakes already with still time remaining, but that will be the final score. 81. Para sa JRU Heavy Bombers, 53. Para sa CSB Blazers, Coach Berhel Meneses will get win number four in seven games played so far sa season 93 ng NCAA. We will take a quick break, but we will wrap things up after. Stay with us, Nito Lamang sa SNA. Again, our final score sa ating pakatlong laro ngayong biyernes. Labing walo ng Agosto. 81-53, favor of JRU. Dealing uh, CSB, their sixth loss in eight games played in Season 93. Ang ating cherry for PGM, Tangkad Sagad, scorer of the game is John Urban Grospe from Giginto, Bulacan, playing his last year and the team captain ng JRU Heavy Bombers. Siya ang ating cherry for PGM, 10-22. Sagad. Scorer of the game, 14 points, 5 assists para sa BSBA management major. At uh, nag-aagal din sa Angel of Light Academy, Bulacan, back in high school, 23 years of age. 6'4". You know, if he continues to be consistent mm -hmm. and improves his game even more and even bulks up, he may have a, a career maybe in the pros. Yes. Of course, walang, uh, walang posible. Pag ginusto mo, you just have to work for it and grab that opportunity. At mga remaining games on Tuesday, on August 22, at 12 noon, it will be the College of St. Benil Blazers, who are now two wins and six losses, taking on the Arellano University Chiefs, who are two and five. Then at 2 p.m., the still undefeated Lyceum of the Philippines University Pirates with their 8-0 card. Be challenged by the Mapua University Cardinals. And then at 4 p.m., third game on Tuesday will be the Emilio Aguinaldo College Generals, Kanina Natalos, San Sebastian Stags. And they will go up against another team that lost yesterday. It's a perpetual help Alta. Seren, always a pleasure covering a game with you. Same here, bro. And for everybody from SNA, for the Rain Man, Coach Red Red Ritualo, Princess Legasco, our director, Al Neri, our game producer, Mark Morados, our floor director, Leanne Han, and our Sultan of Stats, Pong Ducanes. Maraming salamat po sa inyong panonood ng NCA the whole week. Have a great weekend. Ako po si Andre Felix. Kami po yung magbabalik sa Martes. And keep on watching the NCAA on SNA. Have a great weekend.